Hi there, Stanton here from Algo Trading. Today I'm introducing to you the Universal EA. As the name suggests, this is the EA that you could use for pretty much any trading strategy, any time frame, and any symbol. The EA consists of 8 indicators and over 80 trading variations. Okay, so let's take a look at the input parameters. Okay, we have our main setting parameters a comment, magic number, if you want to print out the log, and the max buy and sell positions. We also have the standard money management as per my other EAs. And let's go through the indicators. The first indicator is the moving average. So we have a fast moving average and we've got a slow moving average. So there's two types of trading um, variations on this one. You could either say an MA crossover, so the algo will enter when the MA is crossed over, or you could use it as a trend indicator. And the rest of the settings are pretty self-explanatory. We've got our stochastic settings. Again, we have two trade variations on the stochastic. So either we could check if it could exceed the levels, which are 80 and 20, and or it retraces back from the level. So it crosses above, in the case of a sold entry, it will cross above 80 and then cross below 80 and then the algo will solve. So there's two trading variations on the stochastics. So either it's above the level or it retraces back through the level. RSI works pretty much the same way. We have our level up and our level down. And either you could signal it to enter a trade when it retraces back from the levels or when it exceeds the levels. A Bollinger band settings. And each of these has an input parameter of trade true or false. So if you want to use that setting, you would set this to true. Please make sure you always have at least one um, indicator set as true, else it would just randomly enter in the market. Okay, the next one is our Bollinger Bands. Again, you'll set true or false if you want to use this. And then same as the RSI, so either we say it's above or below the band, we will enter a trade, or if it crosses from above or below, crosses back from the above and below bands. Our fractal settings, fractals, the shift is how many fractals back you wish to enter, and fractal time frame, all of these have got time frames, so you could add multiple indicators from multiple time frames. Fractal time frame, so we'll say if two fractals back, if the current price is above or below that fractal, a trade will be entered into. CCI settings, again, pretty self-explanatory, um, the up level and the down level. This should actually be set to 100 and minus 100, but it's up to you to configure this the way you want to. Alligator settings, again, this is another trend indicator that we could use. So essentially we have two trend indicators in the moving average and the alligator. Our MACD settings, we have also two trade types on the MACD. So either the signal line crosses the main line, it will cause a buy or sell trade, or we could use the MACD trend. What that does, it takes the last three uh, MACD lines and says, are, the, are they incrementing? So if the the second is bigger than the third, and the first is bigger than the second. Okay, so those are our indicator settings. We have our standard trading time settings, so you could choose which days and which hours you want the algo to trade. And I've also added a news filter to this, so you could trade on news or stop the algo if you don't want to trade during news. Okay, so what I'm going to do, I'm just going to randomly pick two, just to show you how the backtests work. So for instance, we're going to do, uh, let's see, we'll do, we'll trade to the RSI and the, st and the stochastics. So we're going to trade both of these two. Just see so nothing else has been traded. Yes. Um, we're going to see which one is better for both of these, and we're going to see which time frame is better for both of these. Okay, so we've got our time frames. And I'm just going to run a, a fast generic on the one minute open high low close. And for the period, 
and we could do it in the five minute chart, it doesn't really matter, we could choose what we want. Okay, so I'm going to start that, and we're going to look at the agents, I'm just going to run it for a few seconds just to show you that you could configure it to the way you want to configure it. Okay, so we've got a couple, so we're just going to order in, so as you can see there, there's already some profitable trades. And so, 40 trades, nice sharp ratio, so we trace back from levels on the 12 hours and we use the RSI in the 10 minutes. So as you can see there's 100%, I'm starting with 10,000 Rand initial deposit or $10,000 initial deposit, so you can see there's already 100% return on a year's worth of trading. So I'm just going to stop that, you can see there's a few other profitable trades in there as well. Or, or configurations. Uh, let's try something else. I'm just going to set these back to default. The default, everything is set to false. And let's try something like, I don't know, we'll take alligators and fractals. I'm just going to uncheck everything else. Everything's set to false. And I haven't done any configuration of the trailing stops or take profit. This is pure, just based on the indicators. So you could probably configure this to be a lot more profitable. Um, so let's see, let's take, we'll trade the fractals, and we'll keep it to two fractals back, and we'll trade the alligator. And we set the time frame, so we'll decide which time frame to use. And let's run that. So you could see there's already some profitable configurations. So we'll just run it a few more seconds. So already we've got 90% return. So I'm just going to stop it at that. So that just shows you an example of what the algorithm or the EA does. So you could choose whether you want to use all indicators, you could choose whether you want to use one indicator, the choice is purely up to yours. And I think you guys are going to have a lot of fun testing this with the back tester because the variations are endless. So I hope you enjoyed that video. As you could see, all, all of these EAs are available for purchase on my website, which you could access from the YouTube, from my YouTube channel, from by clicking Algo Trading Store. And we have many others. We're currently running a special until the first of February, so you can see some of these EAs are up to ninety percent off. So I hope you enjoyed the video. Please remember to like the video, subscribe as there'll be plenty more coming. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.